It's the end of the world as we know it. Oh yeah, I'm in vlog. <laughs> We're eating breakfast. This is our last meal on the cruise ship. And then they're gonna start calling colors for everybody because everyone has a certain color to leave the ship. We are red, which means we leave at 9.30. That's all it means. Everybody has a color for a different time that they're leaving. And then we're gonna get a taxi to the Greyhound and hop on the Greyhound by 12.30. So we're very sad, but here's New York in New York. What? It's hard to see because it's very foggy, but we're here. We're parked and ready to go home. We are in line to leave. But we don't want to. Bark, bark. This is going to take a while. We've been waiting in line for a while. And they have to go to work in the morning. <laughs> bark, bark. And there's Caleb's uh, dog. So we're not happy, but. We're going home. He's leaving the ship. Ready to go? And we're leaving. Ready, go. This is my last step on the We're going off the ship officially and on to land. And now we gotta go look for our luggage. Dang, this thing is very deep and hard to stay still. It's very beautiful. Huh? We gotta go claim our baggage over there. After getting a taxi <laughs> and going through many things, we are finally on the bus. So we are on the road again. Finally moving. And it's gonna be a six hour ride. Longer than when we first came to New York. It was only a four, four and a half hour ride, something like that. So I'm probably gonna take a nap. And if oh, I a lever. Um, get my nap in, around like a handle you pull it up. then I will edit. But right now, down the side, yeah, the seat belt. I'm just tired. How's everyone doing? Tabby. Caleb, RJ has his headphones on. I'll quote the captain on this. Mom and dad. We have a stop in Connecticut and we'll probably eat something then, but that's not for another, what, three hours? I'm peeling. All right, that's it for now. We're home. So, I didn't vlog. <laughs> As you can tell, I fell asleep on the ride, the bus ride home. It was super long, six hours or more, I don't even know. We left by 12.45 and we got to the station at seven. So as was six hours and 15 minutes and the bus had like seven stops. It was ridiculous. It took forever. We could have been home way before that, but I just slept the whole time. I was tired because we woke up early and I had gone to bed late and there was really not much to do on the bus. There was free Wi-Fi, but the Wi-Fi really sucked. It didn't work that great for me. So basically I was listening to my podcast that I already had downloaded and saved on my phone and I slept. But even with all that sleeping, I still feel groggy. So it's about 10.30 now at night what we did was we came home with the family and dropped off all the luggage. It was very hard for me to vlog anyways because I just had so many things in my hands. I had two luggages, one for each hand, and there was no way for me to hold the camera. You really didn't miss anything except for us, you know, being in the bus the whole time and waiting at the station to get picked up by my uncle. And we had to get Hannah. And so we actually, I could have vlogged when we were at the restaurant, but we stopped at a little restaurant. It was called Boston House of Pizza. I ordered a gyro with fries, and John ordered spinach pie, and we also got chocolate chip cookies. This is the last day of our cheating, I guess you can call it, because we were, you know, fine dining on the cruise ship. Tabby was the only one that stuck to her guns with her vegan diet, and I could have done that, but... I just, I'm just gonna go back on the flow of things t tomorrow. We ate and then we picked up my baby, which is over here. Look at, she's already sleeping. 
Oh, Hannah. Hi, princess. What are you doing? You sleeping? Are you sleeping? Mm, kisses? Kisses? Give me kisses. But she was very much happy to see us. And my friend Amanda told me that she was a delight to have. And she was a good girl. We are not going to unpack tonight because we're exhausted. Tomorrow, Jonathan has a doctor's appointment in Boston. And we pretty much have the day off. So we might check out a new restaurant and chill for the rest of the day and unpack and unwind because we're exhausted so we'll see what tomorrow brings but that's it for today's vlog i know it wasn't much sorry it was just crazy just sleeping and trying to get home and stuff but we are happy to be home happy to be with our baby and ready for a new day all right well Hit that like button and see you next time. Remember to love your life. Bye. Stephanie, oh my god, I can smell that stuff.